this is as far as I go. a Fenrir's domain that has been excavated. It might be recent. I can sense Fenrir's presence. Where does this hole lead? Come on. Fenrir must be lurking within. The air is different here. So this is Niflheim. Fenrir's domain. I've got a bad feeling about this. We should be careful. Keep moving. Fenrir must be hiding somewhere in Niflheim. Odin's servant has come to my aid. Quite the change of heart. I want to thank you. If not for your warning, I would have remained one of Odin's puppets. So, why? Why aid me in battle? Because... The Nagalfar. We must finish it off first.
Hey. Are you all right? How? Oh. She seems disorientated. Wait! She's saying something. How dare my... The All-Father recognizes your deeds. You shall continue your work. Why? Why did Mother and Father have to die like that? If only I had learned of his schemes sooner. What is this? Valkyrie. Valkyrie! What have you been doing? Where are the souls, I ask for? Forgive me, old father. If Fenrir is unleashed once more, it will be chaos. The human souls are vital to maintain order. I understand. Then get back to your task. This instant! Yes, old yes. father. Something is wrong. I have never seen Lord Odin so agitated. The number of souls he amasses seems to increase without end, as do the number of undead on Midgard. Flowers. We are in Niflheim. It seems my memories found their way into you. Ah. Those were your. I want to save this world. What? I will go to Fenrir and Odin and question them. I need to determine whether the Divine are necessary, or whether they are really just our foes. I know you wish to enact vengeance on them, but please, allow me to talk with them first. And if the gods do turn their backs on the world, then I would like your help in defeating them. You're right. All I want is to kill those wretched gods. Be they good or evil, it doesn't matter to me. I see. But I owe you my life. And for that, I can wait. At least until you have asked your questions. Then let us go to Fenrir. Bizarre. Two Valkyries visiting me together. Fenrir, if you overthrow Odin and become chief of the gods, what do you intend to do with this world? Do you wish to save this world? Your life depends on your response. <laughs> Your commitment to your task is admirable, but I don't think you will kill me. 
What? You see, the world's existence depends on the continued survival of at least one pure-blooded god. That means Odin, or me. Odin certainly has no intention of saving the world. So if we both perish, the world will go with us. Fenrir. Is that meant to be a threat? What? Remember, there are two Valkyries here. I have long wished to see the end of the gods. But I do not wish to end the world with them. So that is what you've been plotting. Such insolence. You will pay for your foolishness, Valkyries. This is as far as I go. 